warm welcome to Thailand, this friendly, fun-loving, exotic and tropical nation. From its glittering temples and its tropical beaches, this is a wonderful part of the world to be. And of course, we're in the heart of Bangkok for this Grand Prix Gold Badminton event. We're in Bangkok in Thailand, Southeast Asia, at the Nimi Bhutan National Stadium for the Princess Siri Vanavari Thailand Masters. This is the third event on the Grand Prix Gold calendar, of course, taking much importance, particularly through that first half of the calendar with these uh, important world ranking points up for grabs in terms of the road to Rio. So uh, a lot of big names have turned up for uh, these Grand Prix Gold events, and we're going to see some of them in action here this very evening in Bangkok. Of course, we've had the Malaysia Masters, we've had the India Grand Prix Gold, and this is what we're going to look at here this evening, starting with the uh, mixed doubles affair, local interest with Bodhi Nassara and Samatri Amitrapai in action against the Malaysians Chan and Go. A couple of uh, women singles, could it be an all uh, Thailand final? Ratchanok Intinan and Busanan will be hoping the way that will be the case. Lee Hunil against Tanak Sok of Thailand, and then maybe that final match, the mouth-watering proposition with the world champions of the last three years colliding in the men's doubles semi-final. Mohamed Hassan and Hendra Seriawan up against Ko Hyun and Shin Baekchul. So obviously our first offering is uh, the mixed doubles and this is uh, how Chan and Go got there. You can see the other semi-final. We'll see uh, Zheng Siwei and Chen Jing Chen take on Li Chun Hei and Chao Hui Wa. But we're focused, of course, on champion Chen and Go Liu Ying up against Bodin and Sara and uh, Savitri Amitrapai. From the uh, National Stadium filling up all the time. And now just awaiting the arrival of the players for this opening of the semi-finals. The mixed doubles, a Thailand-Malaysia confrontation. On court one, mixed double. Semi-finalists. Berdin is Sara, Lasa, Wiki, Amitai, Ta, Prate Thai. Captain thanks to Lagoliu Ying, Japate, Malaysia. Gamakan, Buddha Sin, Fishau, Yu Shen, Japate, Team, Hai Bay. Gamakan, 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 Gam Empire, Cho Yoshin, Chinese Taipei, Service Judge, Klaus Sliven, Australia. Well, you heard the introductions there. Go and Chan in the red. And on the opposite side in the black shirts are Bowden and Savitri of Thailand. Never met before. Well, our umpire here is uh, Chao Yu Chen doing the uh, usual Preliminaries, deciding who will serve first, who will be which end. And I suppose uh, for the Thai pair, Bodin Isara and Savitri and Mitrapai, they can swing it easy, really. No real pressure on them, of course. They'd love to do well here in front of a, a home crowd in the capital city of Bangkok. But uh, the expectations, as they have been all week, is that they won't progress to the final. Of course, uh, for Champagne Sin and Go Liu Ying, there will be that expectation. <laughs> Bodin Isara, of course, uh, 26 year old, who is, uh, well, 
been in the news, shall we say, the last couple of years. Of course, a very famous incident in Canada that saw him banned for the game for two years. Uh, but he's uh, back in the swing of things, came back uh, just under a year ago. And, uh, well, got a chance to qualify for the Olympics in the men's doubles, has to say, alongside Savitri here, the 28-year-old, uh, the chance of making it through to the Olympics are uh, pretty remote. Ranked 47 in the world, they are as a combination. But they've uh, they've done pretty well, and in fact, you have to say this week, they've done extremely well. Of course, some really big surprises. So confidence must be sky high for them. And this is how they got there. Uh, particularly look at that round one on day one here. The big upset, they beat the Korean pair of Shin Baekchul and Cha Yu Jung in straight games as well. I mean, worth noting the numbers two, four, five, and six seeds were all knocked out in the uh, first round. Then they came through a, a three-setter against the Hong Kong pair of Chan and Se. And uh, yesterday, on court just over half an hour, beating Fadila and Angreni of Indonesia in straight sets. So pressure's off them, and the pressure very much on the uh, pair from Malaysia. Chang Peng Sung alongside Go Liu Ying. Okay. Chang, 27 year old. 28, I should say. Looking to uh, qualify for his second Olympic Games alongside Go. Of course, as uh, she suffered with some bad injuries in uh, recent times, eight months on the sidelines before coming back. And uh, you feel like that time away maybe has refresh them as a pair as you can see very straightforward in terms of their progress so far this week straight games all the way including against uh, another Thai pair yesterday they probably thought they were going to uh, meet Praveen Jordan and Debbie Sisanto in the quarterfinals yesterday but they were one of the big name seeds that went out in that first round so the uh, path made it a little easier by Praveen and uh, Debbie getting knocked out. As you can see there, they have never met before. Confirmation, it's Chao Yu Chen, who is our umpire. And Klaus Schlieben from Austria is our service okay. judge. Ladies and gentlemen, David. Am I right? Bottin is Sarah and the Saviti Amitabha, Thailand. <laughs> and on my left, John Peng Song, Go Liu Yun, Malaysia. <laughs> Saviti Amitabha to serve to John Peng Song. Love ball, play. So the semi-finals here getting underway at the Princess Siri Vanavari Thailand Masters. A new event, of course, it was only back in October. We had another Grand Prix Gold event here, oh. the Thailand Open as oh. Savitri Nets. One, love. Chance for a place in the final for an unseeded pair. You have to say the Malaysians here, even though these pairs have never met, will be the oh. favourites, but there's a... Nice little confidence booster as Savitri One. finds the gap. Oh. 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 Service over. Two, well, she's one. not sure, go whether she'll stay in the game after the Olympics in August. Says it all depends on the uh, conditions of her legs. You can probably see she's got straps on both knees. She's had to have work done to both of them. That's oh. it by Chan. event that uh, has been organized in the honor of Her Royal Highness Two, Princess oh. Siri Venavari, former national team player in Thailand. Oh. And 
could see quite a lot of Thai participation. There's only one semi-final we'll be watching without ties as Bowden lets his uh, strength show there. Well, he set it up nicely, really. Seven silver. It's a pretty poor miss by Savitri. Bowden unable to find a way Three, through, but the uh, two. It was there for the taking, wasn't it, from the Thai player? that time though didn't it semi silver and you have to say three they, uh, have oh. tried to take the initiative certainly a very aggressive start from Bodin Asara it was short there for the hitting oh. and missing this time from Savitri semi ah. silver four three there from Bowden. Gone with uh, pure aggression mainly in the rallies, but there. Four. Showed oh. a little more finesse when it maybe was there. I think that's what caught. Go uh, a little bit by surprise, got her on the hills. So a pretty even start, four points. So start of this semi-final. Both pairs reaching the quarter-finals of the side mode in the any uh, event that oh, Sarah and Savitri uh, played in. Five, four. So this mistake by Savitri gives the uh, Malaysians the edge. Chan and Goat also quarterfinals in India, but reached the semi-finals of the Malaysia Masters. So they played in all three of the Grand Prix Gold events on offer. There's no uh, Super Series events this time of the year. Padin, Padin, come here. Okay, change. Don't throw straight. Oh, use towel. Okay. Okay. Just uh, the umpire saying not to uh, spray s sweat. Hold in there on the court. Six, four. To use a towel instead. Maybe just starting Seven, to assert some four. authority then. Okay, from that service mistake from Savitri. The tight net shot from Bode in there. Oh. Well, they've done well to stick in this round, haven't they, the Malaysians? Good idea from Go Liu Yun, but she's put it wide. But credit there to Bodin Asara in that round. Five, he seven. He really was uh, the dominant force, but clever idea from Go. Just couldn't quite put it off. Oh. Oh. Six. Ah! 
there's no doubt about it. If they can start stringing some points together, they're going to get the Seven. crowd on their side. Oh. Oh. Oh, well played. Oh, my goodness, what a retract. <laughs> what a rally this is turning out to be. Absolutely fantastic. Wonderful defence all round. To be honest, I thought the point had been won there for a moment by the ties. Well, I wonder whether we'll see a, a better point all evening here. Some wonderful recovery work all over the court, really. Not just from uh, the Thais, but from the Malaysians as well. Yeah, uh, disappointing way yeah, for it to end, I suppose, in the end. But not as far as the uh, Thai supporters were concerned. Well. Don't worry, you're not missing any action. The players are toweling down yes. while we're seeing this replay. Eight, seven. Four points in a row okay. from uh, Bodhi Nasara and Savitri Amitalapai. Just when you wonder whether the Malaysians were going to get away. <laughs> it's incredible, isn't it? You have a rally like that. that last some team points and then boom, Eight. boom. Oh. Next point's all over. Bowden was trying to beat that. If so, it was a big error. But he's played very well so far in this match. Normally in the mixed doubles, it's uh, well down to the domination, isn't Service it? Fault Service fault, fault there, cool. Against Go Liu Ying. Nine. Oh. As I say, normally it's the. Uh, Female domination at the net, Savitri or Go, but uh, to say Bowden's played very well so far. Turning into a good match already. Oh. Yeah, that's very well done by Chan. Service over. 10, 9. Nice disguise. Play, no. Over 11 10. So it's Chan, interval. Pang, Sun, and Go, Liu Ying, who uh, have an advantage at the interval, although not much of an advantage. Okay. Just that okay. one point lead, okay. 11 10. Been a pretty good start to the match, hasn't it? Twenty seconds. Hot one twenty seconds. Well, 
nothing much between them so far. Obviously, as the uh, scoreline suggests, Bodid and Savantry only been together as a partnership since uh, July 11, 10. competitively. Play. Of course, it's been a, a long time together for the Malaysian pair. Seven international oh. tournaments they've won since their partnership came together in 2009. 11 all. Bodin and Savantry did end uh, 2015 by winning a couple of international challenge events in Malaysia and Bahrain. So they've got a couple of wins under their belt fairly recently. But I don't think they expected to be in the semi-finals, but they're more than holding their own. Ah! Ah! over. 12, 11. Again, the uh, Asian pairs get three points away. And, uh, again, beautifully judged by Bowden and Sarah. Similar warning there from the umpire to the one he gave oh. to uh, Bowden, just regarding sweat, so nothing too much importance. Oh. That was in. Perfect. Right in the corner. 13. 14. Yeah, beautifully guided by Bowden. He was uh, left mistakenly so. Fourteen. Oh. Well, for the second time in this opening game, the. Uh, Malaysian pair get three points oh. ahead. And, uh, over. Another service mistake. Just short 15, that time. 14. every reason given what they've uh, done 15, this week for them to be confident oh. and they are playing with great freedom that's really well done at the net by Savitri Done. That was such an important point, and it was perfectly played by Go Liu Ying there. There was no panic, was there? 
just guided it cross court. And is this the uh, the vital move then at the end of this first game? Oh. Uh, after uh, picking her up on the last point, and took a swipe and missed it that time, didn't she go? Where'd it go? Uh, behind me. Just long. Seven silver. 18, 16. So close from Bowden, it was wide. Correctly given out. 19, 16. Uh, you can see what he was trying to do. The gap was there. Just missed it. Uh, such an important time for the third time in this match. Chan and Gogo, -Go, three points ahead. This time with only two points to win the game. But then another service fault goes against the Malaysians. Seventeen, nineteen. Oh, <laughs> well, well played. I mean, go straining everything to get these back. 18. It wasn't far away from 19. playing a miraculous shot there, but as it is, it tightens up again. It's the way the pendulum has swung, hasn't it? The Legions get ahead and back come the tie pair. Game points have uh, arrived for Chan and Go this time. 20, game point 18. Not without a fight, but edging closer to this opening game. There you go. Well, you've got to say Bernie Nassara and uh, Savitri uh, Mitropai fought hard in that opening game. And uh, in the end, they just had that calmness to uh, seal this game. Did Chan Peng Sun and go Liu Ying. Thank you. So it's the Malaysian pair. And it's the winning point that take this opening game. 21 points to 18. Is there any way back in it for, uh, you have to say, the surprise package in these mixed doubles semi-finals, Bodin Asara and Savitri and Mitropai.
us. Okay, thank you. Second game, oh. love all play. Oh. Oh. Service over, one love. Well, it's uh, there's plenty to oh. encourage Bowden and Savitri, isn't there, from that opening game, but you just feel, don't you, that now that Chan and Go have taken it, you'd be very surprised if they didn't see this one off in straight games, but we shall see. They're mixing it up nicely now, Bode and Asara. All a bit gung-ho at the start of the match, maybe to rid him of those nerves. at that Over. just a little bit one oh The semi-final has uh, already been done and dusted. Very, very convincing win it as well. It is for Zheng Siwei and Cheng Ching Chen, the Chinese teenagers. So whoever wins this semi-final are in for a, a tough Two, time, it would seem. One. They've uh, seen off Li Chao Hoi and uh, Chao Hoi Wa. Over. Two. All. Yeah. Correction. Out. But it was given in by the uh, over. line judge, but Three, two. the umpire overall said it was out. And uh, I think even though Chan blocked our view a little bit, I think the uh, umpire got that one right. It was just short. Get on that, I'm afraid. Four, two. Well, it's nice for Chan there that they're uh, first on, I suppose. Now he's got a little boy. Oh! Not yet at his bedtime, so I'm sure he's watching. Five, 
And uh, I'm sure the way the scoreline is going right now, his uh, family watching in Malaysia will be, uh, will be satisfied by what's going on. An early three-point lead. Already a game to the good. Seemingly in control, but then... Then again. Three, five. Junior champions who uh, await next. Six dollar. Four, six. Thailand. Have to go back to the Thailand Open in October for the last time. Chen Ching Cheng and Zheng Si Wei last lost. Okay, hello. And there's been a few events in between. So they're going to be a tough nut to crack in the final, whoever does get to play them. Which at the moment, you have to say, it looks as if it will be going Chan. But uh, Five, there was a, a sense of freedom for Bodin Asara and Savitri and Mithra Pai having got this far but well, there's certainly that freedom now they're again down six five down oh. go for their shots when needed oh. Oh. Over. seven five Played by Gomez, it looks so easy. Over. Nine, six. Well, as far as Thai hopes are concerned, and uh, there was only one Thai representative in the semi finals of the Thailand oh. Open here. And I say here, it was uh, not far from here in Bangkok back in October. That was Ratchanok Intanon. She lost in the uh, semi finals. You have to say, this was the outside hope. Uh, moving bullet from 
Verdi Nassara, wasn't it? Nine. There was no getting that one back. I no wonder the cameraman couldn't pick it up. It was moving that fast. Easy seven to chat. Cover. Ten, seven. Whoa. Yeah, well left. Eleven, seven. So it seems uh, fa fairly more routine, doesn't it, for uh, Chan and Go in this second game. Maybe, maybe they've uh, extinguished those hopes for Bowden and Savitri. 11-7 they lead to the Malaysian pair in this second game. Many seeds knocked out early on. It really was opened up Caught this draw. Caught one twenty seconds. Caught one twenty seconds. I have to say it's been a pretty good path for this Malaysian pet. I think they probably were expecting a tougher ride to a, a potential final. Eleven seven. But here they Eight. are in the semi-final and a game up. 11-7 up and of course they are in the 11th spot right now in those road to Rio rankings so they're on course and this will do them no oh. harm at all ah. 12 7 haven't had to meet a single seed on the way to the final And uh, that will continue because, of course, the fact that they've been playing a lot of junior tournaments, as you would given their age, they won't meet a seed in the final either because Yang Si Wei and Chen Ching Chen are unranked here this week. 13-7. But believe me, they will be uh, a tough proposition. There is some real talent there amongst the world junior mixed double champions. Ah. 14, 7. Now starting to move away, aren't they? Five straight points for the first time in the match for Chan and Go. Well, I think Savitri thought she was about to play a winner there, but uh, they got it back. Defensive work for the Malaysians now. A chance to turn the shuttle around here. And they've got the winning point. Very 15, well done indeed. Seven. that run of uh, six straight points but Eight, it's a long, long way back now isn't it for Odin and Savitri Over. 16 8. Well, three times 
Shevchenko and Chan won last year. Won the Polish Open, the Russian Open, the Mexico City Grand Prix as well, but nothing at Grand Prix gold level. Of course, they have won a Super Series title. That was back in 2012 when they won in Japan, Malaysia's first major title in the mixed doubles. This millennium proved to be the only one so far. indeed and uh, goes having a fine time of it right now at the net is she mistakenly left by Savitri oh. four points away from the win <laughs> she's got her eye in now hasn't she 18, 9, 14, 14, no, 10. Well, deflated feeling, I suppose, now for Bowden and Savitri. It kind of went toe to toe, didn't they, in that uh, opening game? And that's out as well. But. Uh, 19, 9. The uh, steam, or the air, I should say, quickly leaving the balloon, isn't it? Service over. 10, 19. Yeah, good flick serve. Well retrieved as well by Chan. Well, that's some bad news, wasn't there, for Ty Babington. I don't know if you heard that yesterday. Former mixed doubles world number one, Sarali Tongtungkam, decided to uh, hang up her racket after suffering a serious knee injury during her match on Wednesday. It's why uh, Chunhei and Chao Hui Wa got a walkover and to retire from that quarterfinal yesterday. So uh, she'll be missed. 36 years of age now. Obviously uh, trying their best to get those Olympic points, but uh, a bad knee injury, I'm afraid. That's well done. Of course, Seven over. go. Liu Ying can tell you all about knee injuries. 20. But uh, thankfully they're 11. in the past. And the drums start beating. To the rhythm of nine match points. Oh, uh. Oh, uh. Not this time. Service over. Well, they had the experience well, and. Surely they got the know-how as well. It's a question of time. Chan just wide with that attempted winner. Oh. When he does get them off the meat of the rack, and I think he broke a string doing it there, Bodin Asari. He does generate some really big power. Be quick. to be for Thailand and uh, the Malaysian camp. 13, 20. And forward it seems to a mixed doubles final. A couple of match points saved. Make that three. There's no doubt about it Sara. That incident 14, in Canada apart, he's got some 20. talent, hasn't he? Oh, oh. And there you 
go wide yeah. from Savitri. It uh, was a good match. Second game, you have to say, uh, a little more one-sided. Once uh, Bowden, Asara and Savitri uh, the pipe lost the uh, the necessary level to match their opponents, but they played their part this week. They've done so That's well to make the semi-finals. For, for Chan Peng Sun and Go Liu Ying, a chance to win at Grand Prix goal level for the first time since 2012. They will meet the. Chinese teenagers, the world junior champions of Zheng Siwei and Chen Jingchen. But for now, they can savor a very satisfying semi final win over Bodhinisara and Savitri Amitrapai. The final scoreline in uh, just over 40 minutes was 21 18, 21 40. So the first of our semi-finals concluded and a straight games win for Chan and Go. Next up, it's the first of two women's single semi-finals we'll see on this court here this evening at the National Stadium in Bangkok as Busanan Ong Boom Rungpan takes on Sun Yu. See at the uh, top of your screen, Sun Yu seeing off uh, Ip Wee in yesterday pretty comfortably. And Abusanan seems to be getting stronger as well, uh, coming up against the uh, young Indonesian rising star, Dina Dia Ayestin. So you have to say both players coming through pretty comfortably. Going to be some matches in it, the uh, singles match we've got coming up a little later between Sun Ji Yun and uh, Rachanok Intanon. That's the fourth match on this court. But right now, we're concentrating on this women's singles between China's Sun Yu and Thailand's Busanan. On court one, women's single, semi finalists. Busanan Ung Bamrung Pan, Jack Pratet Hai, Gav Sun Yu, Jack Pratet Jean, Gamagan Putasin, Kun Bong Wai Lei, Jack Pratet Jean, Makao. Representing Thailand, Busanan Ong Bung Rong Pan.